2020, COVID-19 forced Radha Shrestha to close her business, leaving her without an income. अनि अब बीचमा लकडाउन भयो कोभिडले हामीलाई एकदमै गाह्रो गर्यो कोभिडको टाइममा चाहिँ हाम्रो दिदीबहिनीहरू घरमै बसिराख्ने काम गर्नलाई उहाँहरूलाई केही नभएको एकदमै गाह्रो भयो राडा वाज वन अफ 2.7 मिलियन माइक्रो स्मल एन्ड मिडियम साइज एन्टरप्राइजेस और एमएसएमईज इन नेपाल हु वर अफेक्टेड बाय द पेन्डेमिक इन नेपाल the pandemic forced 52% of businesses to temporarily close, while 83% of businesses saw a decline in sales by 60%, and 88% instituted leave without pay or reduced hours or wages. These challenges exacerbated existing inequalities that MSME owners face, with 37% of these businesses already unable to access finance for growth. This is particularly the case for women entrepreneurs who face a 1.6 billion dollar finance gap unable to access finance due to cultural and social biases, limited property ownership that can be used as collateral, inadequate access to networks, and lower financial and digital capabilities. With lockdowns and limited transportation, it became clear that MSMEs that are resilient to crises are those that have the digital financial literacy and technological solutions to bring their products to clients. In 2022, UNCDF, with support from the Swiss Agency for Development and Cooperation, launched a digital initiative to help businesses in Nepal get back on their feet and become more resilient to future shocks. MSMEs form the backbone of Nepal's economy, creating millions of jobs and providing essential goods and services to people every day. Together, UNCDF with the Swiss Agency for Development and Cooperation, we partner with e-commerce platforms and industry associations to advance the inclusion of these MSMEs in the country's digital economy. We worked at multiple levels with several partners to ensure MSMEs could confidently use digital services. First, we worked with e-commerce platforms, Sasto Deal and Tulo, and MSME federations, the Federation of Nepalese Chambers of Commerce and Industry, and the Federation of Nepal Cottage and Small Industries, to design strategies to increase the number of women accessing digital platforms. Working with our partners, we then delivered digital and financial capabilities trainings to over 3000 MSMEs of which more than 65% were women owned small and medium scale enterprises also it is important for them to understand the uh, contemporary issues uh, of the digitalization and uh, to know about the stakeholders mm -hmm. in the market parivar satsar huncha ra parivar satsar huna ko lagi pahile mahila ke satsar garnu parcha we worked with Sastodeal and Tulo to onboard these MSMEs on their e-commerce platforms. Partnering with women-focused NGOs like Women for Human Rights helped to reach more women and support them to register their businesses, build digital literacy, and use digital marketplaces. As one of the leading e-commerce platforms in the country, uh, we said it's our agenda to make sure we, we you know, try and, you know, help uh, bridge this digital divide. So we could not have done it on our own, uh, thanks to UNCDF. Uh, they came with, with capital resources, technical assistance uh, to, you know, uh, help us accomplish this goal. We onboarded more than 2100 MSMEs into our platform and uh, we are successful to digitally transform them. Now, over 4,200 businesses can sell their products through these platforms, including Muna Bajracharya. With the right skills and confidence to access and take advantage of digital solutions, these small businesses can now reach more customers, increase their incomes, improve the management of their businesses, and build their digital footprint, which can help them unlock more finance to grow their business. This is a critical step in Nepal's journey to building an inclusive digital economy.